Hey guys, welcome back to Ancestors and Alcohol. So today I'm back with my last wine review. No, not my last wine review because I will always be drinking wine. My last review in my Flow Wine series. So the first week I did Moscato, last week I did Red Blend, and this week I'm doing the Chardonnay. Um, if you want to learn more about Marcus Johnson who owns Flow Wines, you can go ahead and click the link and it will take you to my first video where I talked a little bit about Marcus Johnson, the jazz pianist, and um, the wines that he has. So today we have the 2014 California Chardonnay. It has 13.5% alcohol and this is a 750 milliliter bottle. And once again, like I've been saying, these don't have the hints or the notes on the back. So you kind of just got to, you know, make your own assumption and figure out what's in it. Which, I mean, can be kind of fun, you know, you figuring out, hmm, do I taste this? Do I taste that? But you'll never know if you're wrong or right. So, try this out. And um, I kind of like Chardonnay's. They just kind of, it just kind of depends, I guess, what type of Chardonnay it is. Um, if it's a sweeter Chardonnay or a drier Chardonnay. Um, so I'm always excited just to try different brands of wine. So that way, you know what you like and you know what you don't like. So this one's a little sweeter. Um, it kind of reminds me of the Moscato that I had, like, from two weeks ago. Um, it just tastes like Chardonnay to me. I don't really taste any hints, like, nothing is popping out to me. Um, the flavors or the notes or the hints. It tastes like a Chardonnay, just like a regular Chardonnay to me, but then it tastes like that Moscato that I had. Um, I would, I would buy it. I would get it. But also if I wanted something a little sweeter, I would just get the Moscato because they, they kind of taste the same to me. Maybe I'm tripping. I don't know. I don't think I am. y'all it just tastes like the moscato it, t it like i said it just tastes like a chardonnay but kind of a moscato it's weird um has anybody tried this before this flow wine chardonnay i would really like to know and see what y'all think and like what y'all got out of it um but like i said you can get this wine um, if you go on Marcus Johnson. I think that's the website. Marcus Johnson 360, I believe. You can order the wine online or you can type in your zip code or your city and it will tell you where you can purchase the wine, like where it's closest to you at. My brother got this in Charlotte. Um, and I think when I was coming back last time, it said that it was in Atlanta, but I'm not sure. Don't quote me. I don't know. I know nothing. Um, but yeah, go on there, try the wine out. If anybody's tried this, please let me know what you think about it. Um, I will be back with some more wine next week. Now that I finished this, um, collection, I think I have some McBride Sisters wines left. Um, or I might just try something else. Also, I want to try this Black Raspberry Ciroc that I've been seeing everywhere. So we'll see, you know, I just switch it up and let everybody know. But goodbye, beautiful black people. I hope that this helped. Thank you for watching. Please make sure that you subscribe, 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 and follow my Instagram and Facebook at Ancestors and Alcohol. Goodbye, beautiful black people.